This is Randy Bell with the Courier Podcast, the place to go for the latest Clinton news. Last year, Mississippi was hit by 50 tornadoes during the months of March, April, and May. And as spring's severe weather season gets underway, Fire Chief Jeff Blackledge is encouraging Clinton residents to make sure they're prepared. And that includes a reliable way to receive warnings no matter where you are. The outdoor warning sirens are just that. They're to warn you when you're outdoors that, hey, we've got impending weather, something like that, and for you to get indoors and seek shelter. Uh, They were never designed to warn you when you were inside your house. He says modern houses are so airtight that the wailing of a distant siren can't be heard inside. And that's assuming they go off at all. At least seven of Clinton's 21 sirens aren't working as they await repairs. Blackledge says in Clinton, the code red phone alert system offers a more location-specific warning. When we set the sirens off, it's because you know we've got a tornado that's headed towards Clinton. We may know the path of it, but I can't go in and just set off the ones on the north side or the south side. He says with code red, areas of the city threatened by a storm or another emergency can be alerted without unnecessarily alarming people who are not in harm's way. You can sign up for the free service on the city's website, clintonms.org. Type in the words code red in the search block. The National Weather Service says people should have multiple ways to receive warnings. It recommends no weather radios, which can be programmed to go off for specific weather alerts affecting the Clinton area. With the Courier Podcast, this is Randy Bell.